they will throw it downfield. Here's Orwin Smith on the toss. Smith to the outside has some room, and he's out of bounds. up. The option again. This time it's straight ahead of the B back, David Sims. And Washington throws it, and it's incomplete. Orwin Smith. Washington will keep it, and that time Duke does a good job. He stopped right at the line. Going to feather it, fourth pitch. On third down, this is optioned off to the receiver, Jeff Green, and Green's tackled as he crossed in. A lot of quarterback follow. Not trying to get him off sides. Nope. No, they'll run the play. Washington options to Orwin Smith. He breaks loose into the secondary. A first down finally brought down at the 35. State too. That was more of a homage to Daryl Royal, their late head coach. Smith again on the pitch. Dives across the 30. That's Lasky getting the call. He stepped into the game as the B the wings. They're called the A-backs in the option. The B-back is the fullback. That's the quarterback, Washington, and he's got a pass attempt. Two pass attempts. Washington floats one to Smith. And he's pushed out of bounds at about the two-yard line. Washington will keep it himself. No signal yet. And he, 12th play of the drive. Washington, quarterback keeper. And the second effort sims the B-back. Smith in motion. Washington keeps it. And there's the record. A big old Hatman driving right there. Tevin Washington starts the second series for Georgia Tech. He keeps it on first down, takes a big hit. Gave up a score on Georgia Tech's first drive. North Carolina last week was off a bye, gave up 68. Washington over the middle to Lasky, and it's through his hand, second and 10. Washington options it off to Smith and Orwin Smith. It's to the B back, Lasky, and he's got a yellow jacket for avoid getting lulled to sleep against the pass. You just have to be disciplined with your eyes. Washington again, the counter, and that time has nowhere to go. A nice run there by Dion Hill. Washington's going to go to the air. Pumps, throws, and that's caught by Smith, who steps out of bounds. Here's Washington. Keeps it. Brought down by France. But not this is the beat back in that Sims open sesame. Touchdown, Georgia Tech. Series, bad lead takes over. This is what Georgia Tech did last time against North Carolina. And he options it out on first. Smith in motion. This is Sensing Days. And he's to the 32. A very good relationship with Dave Cutcliffe. This is to the B-back. Strong run there by Sin Brimmer. Here's Godhai, gets a nice block. Godhai springs free. A first down and more into Duke territory. Go back to the other play. Quick screen to Green. And he's tackled immediately. Eyes. False start, offense number 81. Five-yard penalty, second down. Again, the fullback, Lasky taking defenders with him. And he's to the 35-yard ball game. That's why Paul Johnson's got the camo. Lasky again, another strong run. You're going to get a steady dose until you do. Lasky again, one more time. Make them drive the length of the field without giving up any cheap ones. Lee trying to get to the outside and finally taken down. 
teams in the nation, all with potential roadblocks looming. Lasky breaks a tackle, and he's got 11th play of the drive. It's a toss to Smith. Orwin Smith, a couple of nice cuts, and he's down to the 11 yard. 14. You can time a possess, but you got to score. Let's drive alone six minutes. Here's Lee. Brought down by France at the. Got Smith in motion. Lasky, the B back. He's a beast. You get down here to the end zone. You wonder if they've got a little something in the arsenal. To... I'll try Lasky one more time. He stood up. This time they run a toss to Smith. Can he get to the outside? A couple of options to run on the outside. Lee's going to try to keep it. Lee stretching for the end zone, and he's in. Evan Washington got the first two series. Vad Lee with the next two. Lee to Lasky. Makes a man miss. Lasky taken down at the 30-yard line. Out of the pistol. Lee up the middle. Balls on the ground. Back to Duke with a couple of turnovers or timeouts and then have them off have an opportunity to score. Lee hit by Anna Nicky and his pass incomplete. It's Louisiana Lafayette late. Tech does throw here on third down and Lee's pass to set the ACC's all time mark for receiving yards. Tevin Washington starts the third quarter for Georgia Tech and he's the third man. Washington, there's that counter option. And he's taken down again by their, their best corner, also back at corner. He's been playing a lot of safety. And there's Cockrell all over that. He knocked it away. It's caught by the lineman, Bino. And Ray Bino picks up a first down. Tech first down. That's Lasky. Tough yards there on first down. And Lasky, and that time he's met by Norm Deep. Washington quarterback keeper, first down Georgia Tech. This is the 50th play of the game for Georgia Tech. Washington, and that's incomplete. Badly the next two in the first half. Washington back to start the third quarter as Lasky gets the call. And you continually move the football. Washington options to Smith, hauls it in. And Orwin receptions on this team. Sims takes it to the 30. Davis in motion. Sims gets the call and picks up a first down. Washington fakes the option. Ball comes out. That's going to be a forward pass. But, yep. Illegal forward pass beyond the line of scrimmage, number 13 in the offense. That penalty is five yards plus loss of down from the spot of the pass. Second down. Washington will throw. He's got Lasky. Touchdown tech. Kevin Washington still in the game for Georgia Tech. Options to Orwin Smith. It was so good in his two, he played the rest of the game. There's Lasky. Washington. Let's see if he keeps it. No, he'll pitch it. Got high. Run out of string in it out. Washington keeps it. He's going to be too much in Duke. So far, he's kept things fairly simple, assignment oriented. Toss to Smith. Breaks a tackle by Canty, and that second effort's going Here's a give to the B back, Sims. Sims running. Piling it on, isn't it? What was the line from the man who shot Liberty Vance? And the fact is, Duke cannot get him <laughs> off the field. Truth and truth. One of those teams. 
course, they've got to find a way to stop this rushing attack of Georgia. It's a big play. It's been just steady gains as Sims again takes it. The ball for almost 30 minutes in this game. Sims, there's another first down. One, two, three yards. Comes a lot easier. Lasky's across the 20 north of 50 yards. Washington options to Smith. Looking for some room, changes direction. And change the formula. In most of the season, there's Lasky. And he's going to be close. Sims in that B back, fullback position. Washington will keep it. First down and more. Tackled by Cockrell at the 11th. The ball, Duke's not going to stop them. Well, they stopped him there. Helton, 17th play of the drive. You heard right. Washington. Gets out of bounds. The pistol formation here on third down. Washington has a man open. Touchdown, got high. They didn't, the only time they didn't score was at the end of the first half when Tech got it with about a minute left. Five plays clearly dominating the offensive side of the football. Here's Lasky. And you get the fence. Washington will run it. He's going to be tackled. Off schedule. Illegal motion. Offense number 10. Five yard penalty. Third down. Run the option. That's to Jeremy Moore. The wideout. Tackled shy of the first down. You not see the football again. Lasky met right at the line of scribble from pose a postseason ban. Would get to the ACC championship game by beating Duke next week, regardless of what happens today. Tevin Washington picks up another. You said it before, it's been a slow death. Georgia Tech grinding offensively. It's been a lot of that. Vernon's also the ACC's all-time leader in career receptions. Washington keeps it himself. Tackled by Fox. Great teams, those guys are that way. Bad teams, chemistry problems, ego problems. Washington to the air, incomplete. He wanted Godhigh, who was streaking. Good chance, back in the pistol. Washington for Godhigh. Dagger. Beaten before, but just trying to ignore this. Decal on the helmet. Gold. Becomes Duke's biggest cheerleader if Miami does not self-impose a postseason ban. Seem like every week you're shaking your head saying, tell me who beat who again?